hello guys and welcome back to today's video my name is Zig the programming guy in today's video guys i want to show you how to go live on tiktok with games all right so if you want to play games on your tiktok live this video is for you so we're actually going to be doing this is in tiktok live studio all right so for those of you who don't have the mobile gaming feature on your tiktok app so this is a chance for you to learn how you can actually do it using the tiktok live studio all right so like i said it's very easy um so let's get started guys um, so I'm going to post the game all right so the first thing we have to do guys is to make sure our internet connection is turned on and um, this TikTok live studio application is only available for Windows at the moment so you just have to download and install the TikTok live studio application on a Windows system um, I have a video now you can actually do that so I'm going to add the video at the end of this one so once you have the TikTok Live Studio downloaded and installed on your system, so the next thing you have to do is go ahead and open it, and then you have to log in um, to your TikTok account. All right. So after logging in, you land on the studio. So this is actually my studio. All right. So I'm just going to get this out of the way so that we can start the process all over. All right. So this is actually the interface you're going to um, see. So what am I going to do from here? So what I'm just going to do from here is to um, come down here, click on add a scene. So by the way, you're not going to see all this right here. So I'm going to remove this because you're not going to see it there. All right. So um, you're just going to see only this. Um, and this is actually called scene. All right. So it's um, it's a scene. So um. If you want to add another scene, if you want to use a different scene, you can come down here and click on this add scene, click on add scene, and then you'll get all this different scene right here. Um, before you uh, click on that, you can choose to use a landscape or a portrait mode. All right, so I prefer using the landscape mode. So after that, click on the add scene and you can now choose your scene. So for the scene, we have the landscape, we have, um, sorry, we have general scene, we have chat scene and uh, we have blank scene so i'm going to actually choose this first one which is general scene and then i'll click on add all right so as you can see it's added right here and it comes with this um, video source so these are video, video sources all right so what we're going to do now um so this is the scene so what i'm just going to do is to remove some of this um from this scene so I'm going to remove this background and if I want to do that I'm going to just come here click on settings um, or I can just right click on any of them just like this and then I'll get um, the delete option all right so that is deleted um, I'm going to leave this one so this is the camera I'm just going to drag and drop it right here and uh, then I can just increase it a little bit yeah just like this all right so the next thing we have to do is to click on this add source so we are going to add uh, one more source so i'm going to click on add source and uh, then after clicking on the add source let's wait for it to load all right so after clicking on that you get all this so these are some other sources i can add to my scene but um, the one i want to add is this one which is cast ios i'm going to click on this cast ios because i'm actually using an ios device i'm using an iphone so i'm going to click on cast ios and then i'll come down here and click on add all right so in order for me to um cast my ios to this scene um first of all there are two ways to actually do it there's the wired casting and wireless casting so if you want to use a usb um cable to connect to this you have to you go for the wired wired casting but if you don't want to use your usb cable then you have to go for the wireless casting but i prefer this one which is a wired casting so i'm going to click on that one and then in order for you to cast your ios device to this scene you have to first of all use your usb cord all right so you have to get your usb cord and then connect to your pc and then connect to the um, ios device all right so once that is done automatically a driver will start installing all right so once this is checked then a driver will start installing then 
after that driver is then started successfully this will be checked and then the third one is that you, you need to make sure your mobile screen is unlocked all right so once your mobile screen is unlocked then uh, you can now proceed to the fourth step which is to add source so as you can see right here you can um you can now click on this add source button right here so once that is clicked then my iphone is going to be casted to my sin so let's wait for it guys so i think this is obstructing this background is obstructing i think we need to remove it from here so this is it this image so i'm going to right click on it and click on delete as you can see it's right here it's showing but the image was obstructing so i still have to remove this one as well so i'm going to right click on it and click on delete i'm going to do the same for this one i'm going to delete it all right so um this one also i'm still going to delete it so these are some sources that was added to the scene it came with the general scene so all right so we just have only the iphone showing on our scene so what am i going to do now so as you can see it's just the camera which is this one and the casted ios device all right so we have only two sources so now what am i what i'm just going to do next is to um click on this ios device which is my iphone and then i'm going to rotate it so how can i do that now you once you click on it if you look right here there's this options right here so the second one is for you to rotate so i'm going to click on that and it will rotate just like this so once it rotates i can um, stretch it so um, i can just come right here and stretch this part after stretching i can do the same for this side and then i can do the same for the bottom yeah just like this and then what i just what i'm just going to do now is to open a game on my phone so i have this game right here all right so this is the game so this is the game so what i'm just going to do now is to play this game so i'm going to click on resume on my phone and then i can start playing this game right away um, so what we have to do next guys is to click on the go live button down here so that we can now go live and continue playing our game so i'm going to click on the go live button so after that you have to choose a topic so you can click right here to choose a topic so um there are different topics right here so we have gaming chat and interview blah 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 so i'm playing a game so i'm going to choose this one gaming so if it's a popular game you find it right here so for example um uh, we are playing a car racing game and i don't think the name of the game is here because it's not actually a popular game so let me just check though um it's not here so it has to be a popular game before you can see the name right here so for example i'm just going to select one of this one i'm going to select one of this and then you can go live immediately but there are some other things you would like to add such as some um, cover image or you can just select this one to auto screenshot and use any part of it as your cover image and uh, the next thing you want to do is to add a title um this one is just the one i added previously so you can change it so what else you can edit about yourself all right so um, these other ones are some settings you would like to take a look at all right so after the, all these then you just have to go ahead and click on go live and once you do that you'll be live and uh once you're live you have to continue playing your game because that's the essence of this video all right so this is how you can actually go live on tiktok playing a game hope this video was helpful if it was give this video a like and you probably subscribe to get more info tips like this um by the way i have a playlist on how you can use a tiktok live studio app application so if you would like to check it out i'll add it at the end of this one thanks for watching guys